This video uses the Endurica CL and the Endurica ANSYS extension. We will be calculating fatigue life for an automotive aluminum reinforced rubber seal with two different proposed geometries. The 2D plane strain finite element model is opened in ANSYS Workbench Mechanical and a name selection is created for the rubber material. The seal is fixed at one end while a push rod is displaced towards the seal and then back to its original position. This represents one cycle. The Endurica export tool is opened and the rubber elements are selected along with the desired history increments. The data will be exported to a text file where the output requests and material for the fatigue analysis have already been defined. This file is copied and then selected in the export window. For the history section of the HFI file, the history is selected as plane strain and hydrostatic pressure will be included. A default temperature for the fatigue analysis is also given and the export button is clicked. Checking the HFI file shows that the history section was correctly appended. Next, the history data is written to the field section of the HFI file and the file is again checked. The input file is now complete and the fatigue analysis is submitted through the run job window. After the job is complete, a fatigue life result is created and the output file from the fatigue analysis is selected. The life will be written to every result set as the log of the life for better visualization. Reversing the color scheme shows the regions with lower life in red. A similar fatigue analysis was then performed on a second seal model to explore the effects of geometry on fatigue life. This new geometry has a minimum predicted fatigue life about four times greater than the original geometry.